Davina, how about you go next? Davina? Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, oh, shit, that's me. Um, oh, ah, <laughs> uh, my bad. Hey, y'all. Um, yes, I'm Davina, or D for the new people here. Um, she, her, and this is my last day here. And um, I'm, I'm grateful that I get to spend time with my boyfriend tonight. But a little, like, sad, to be honest, or nervous, or both. I'm not too sure. Uh, left and right brain, remember? Yes, but I can see you're already thinking of the negatives. Yeah. <laughs> so what's causing us to feel this way? I'm just nervous, I guess. Um, one, this is my first time seeing Sebastian, like, since the hospital. And two... He doesn't know about any of this and just thinks I've been like MIA because of classes and grad school stuff. And three, I haven't dressed up in a while. So what if he thinks I'm ugly? And like the real reason I wanted to go out was to celebrate graduating IOP. But I like obviously can't say that because then I have to like tell him everything and he'll think I'm a freak or that I'm ugly or like, I don't know. I just feel really, I don't want to feel okay. stupid. I feel stupid. Okay. Okay. So number one, remember, we have to check our facts. Is Sebastian really going to do all of those things? No, I don't know. I mean, it's okay to not be sure, but that's why we have the cope ahead method, remember? So number one, describe the situation you're in, like you just did. Number two, decide what actions we can take to problem solve and cope. And number three, think of the most extreme and the most normal possibilities. And number four, cope ahead and prepare. So even if the smallest bump in the road happens, you can feel prepared. I guess I'm not necessarily like coping for what he's going to say, but like, like rather like actually saying it to somebody, you know, mm. like I've never talked to anyone about this stuff and I just, I feel really gross talking about it. And I, I don't know <laughs> how to even describe it. It's, it's like, what if when I say it to someone who knows me for something, like, other than that, they'll think I'm weak, like, like I'll never be the same in their eyes and said be seen as the girl who has a problem or some super freak that needs to be babysat 24-7 in case she tries to earn it all. Like, I, I just don't want okay. anyone to feel sorry. No, no, I totally get where you're coming from, but we have to remember, are we using our fact-checking skills or are you just assuming? assuming but my facts are i'm afraid and opening up's never been easy well we don't have to open up all the way today remember it's not a sprint it's a marathon exactly you got it so what i would love for you to do is use the cope ahead method for tonight and be prepared before you take off for your date okay okay um, thanks, Miss Vaughn, for everything. I don't know I'm going to make it without you. No, you'll be fine. It was all you. I was just cheering you on. But it's been a pleasure meeting you, Dee. And I'll miss you, but you can always come back, even if it's just for a check-in. Ah, uh, don't tempt me. <laughs> <laughs> Do you remember the first question we asked you when you got here? What do you hope to get out of the end of your time with us? Yeah. So what do you want now? Oh, um, I, uh, I guess I just want to be happy. Yeah. Yeah, I, happy. That's a beautiful answer. All right, everyone. Let's send Davina off. <laughs> we'll miss you. You got this, superstar. Here's to us, my lady. Hey, Taylor. So, how's life been, stranger? What's a stranger? Oh, uh, yeah. I must get all the information I can before you go all MIA on me. Hey, I don't know. Okay. 
Okay, fine. I admit, I did treat you pretty normal. But you're stuck with me. So I'm just simply you Ouch. Who? Well, I can't complain. At least I'm still being considerate. Do you can I tell you something? Um I was actually gonna ask you the same thing. Um, you can go first though. Oh, no, no, go ahead, ladies first. No, no, are you sure? You can go. No, no, I mean, yeah, go. Just no, continue. No, uh, Just go before I make myself a demon devil. Yo, Sebastian! What's up, man? What are you doing here, bro? I can ask you the same thing. Hey, Bryce. Oh, hey, Davina. I almost didn't recognize you without your sweats. Looking good. So, what are you doing here? I thought you were coming for finance. Oh, that class? <laughs> Some of the boys have a whole Google Drive of her answers to the quizzes. Work smarter, not harder, my friend. Plus, I got bored, so I swiped on Tinder a couple of times and found a pretty girl to bring back home and spoil for the night. Yeah, uh, guys, this is, um... Fuck, I forgot your name. <laughs> Did you remind me your name? Britton. Heck yeah, Brit. Uh, okay, well, it was nice meeting you, Brit. Anne and Bryce, I'll see you back. Hey, 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 we just got here. Don't kick us out so fast. <laughs> hey, Britt, uh, I left my uh, water in the car. Would you go get it? Take D with you. Y'all can have a little girls chat while the boys talk. Although I'm not sure how much you'll have in common. D's more of a home person, like a dark, homie cave person. <laughs> I'm just kidding, D. <laughs> oh my God, you're so funny. Bryce, I've actually been meaning to ask you, um, how's Ashley P? Or Nicole S, Brett S. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Was I not supposed to? Oh my bad. Ouch, no, not at all, Big D. Hey dude, cool it with D, okay? Cool it with D? Yeah, she's nice and hasn't done anything to you, so cool it. It's not the fact of her being nice, it's the fact that you're with her. With her? Yes, I mean, I don't care if you get some hard on with some trash, but it is my business whenever you bring it here. Here? You mean into Greek life? Is that what this is all about? Imagine. I'll see. You chose this life. Now you gotta abide by it. You had no problem doing that last year. Do you hear the shit coming out of your mouth, Chris? I mean, you must love it since you're just love her. Yeah, I kind of do. <laughs> what? <laughs> no, you don't. I mean, just look around. Do you think that she has a life here with us? I mean, I wouldn't risk my friend over some freak piece of ass. Oh, is that right? Look, dude, all I'm saying is if someone loves someone, they wouldn't go fuck someone else. It's not even a year into it. I swear, if you ever bring this up, I will fuck you up, you understand? Whoa, 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 calm down, big boy. Don't worry. I wouldn't waste my breath on her. Hey, did we miss anything, lovebirds? Nope, just brother talk. Right, Sebastian? Yeah. So, Britt, I heard you're in tried out. Yeah, I joined last year. Actually, uh, sorry, not to. We're gonna go. Actually, we are? Yeah. We have some big meeting tonight about our party this weekend. All great gorgs in one place, one night. Remember last year, right, Sebastian? And I'm sorry, I would invite you, Dee, but it's a Greek, a Greek thing, so, um. But you're coming, right, bud? I was actually kind don't worry, we'll get you something small on the way home. This is supposed to end up in my bed anyway. <laughs>